Hey, it's delta 249 here with my updated wrap settings for Minecraft and Flight Simulator X, as well as some performance and quality tips for fraps. Now, if you'd like to see these specs on my computer, you can look in the description just so that you know what I'm using for these settings. Now, the FPS tab, I do not use the benchmarks or overlays very often. Maybe if I get a new game, I'll turn on the overlay to the top left. Uh, but when I'm recording, hide overlay. Don't really need to see my FPS the entire time. It just bugs me. So I hide it, and in the movies tab, I save my movies in series specific folders. So if I'm recording everything Minecraft, I'll save it in the everything Minecraft folder. Um, so that changes whatever I'm recording. And if you have another data drive that is just for files, I suggest you save it to that because you will get better performance if you're not using the drive that you're recording on or the program is running and the games are running on um, if you're saving to a different drive but I don't have another data drive and I don't have any performance issues so I'm okay and the video capture hotkey I use the number pad star there's not really any reason but that uh, there's no games that I have that use that key so that's why I use it video capture settings for Minecraft I use 30 FPS and half size now people say there's no difference between 30 FPS and 60 FPS. Uh, there is there is a slight difference. I do have to say you can see the difference between 60 and 30. Well, at least I can. Um, and the reason I record in 30 and not 60 is because when I encode it, I like to encode it in 30 FPS anyway. So I just use 30, and I don't really need to use 60 anyway. So um, if you want to use 60, you can, but if you well first of all if you can use 60 then go ahead but I just use 30 because it doesn't matter uh, if I use 60 or 30 it's gonna end up being 30 anyway and I use half size for Minecraft because for Minecraft you can't see a difference but people say you can't really tell the difference on YouTube with full size and half size you can tell the difference but it's just for Minecraft you can't really tell the difference so I use half size and 30 FPS and full size for flight simulator and I use full size because you can see a difference between half size and full size for flight simulator and um, I you try to get the best quality there so full size flight simulator and um, also 30 FPS for both of them and then half size for Minecraft now loop buffer I don't know what that is so I have it at the default of 30 seconds and split movie every four gigabytes I haven't really tried that out and the movies don't even become, aren't even 4 gigabytes. Well, at least the uh, Minecraft ones aren't usually even 4 gigabytes anyway. So I don't use that. And sound capture settings, record Windows 7 sound. I have that checked. And stereo is the bubbled in one. Uh, I tried out multi-channel for a little bit. Didn't really hear a difference, so I just used stereo. And the record external input, I'm using my Blue Yeti. Uh, so whatever's plugged in and whatever's the default will be selected there. You can't really select it. You just have to you select it through your sound settings. Um, and only capture while pushing. I don't have selected because I like to talk freely, not just have to press space or whatever. Uh, so, yep, that's that. Now, hide mouse cursor in video. I do have that checked because it's kind of annoying uh, on things like Minecraft. If you can see the cursor and the crosshairs, I guess. So I have that unchecked. I mean, I have that checked. Sorry, and lock frame out, frame rate while recording. I have that unchecked because it locks it at a certain place, and it can lower your frame rate because it's trying to keep it at a certain place. So it's gonna put it down so that you don't go lower than that point. So I have that unchecked. And force lossless RGB capture. Um, I've never really used this, but I assume it the colors are a little bit better. Uh, again. I for Minecraft it doesn't really matter, and for Flight Simulator I edit there's I add color anyway so again I don't use it I think it's kind of pointless for what I do, and yeah that's about it for the movies tabs so you can look at that and uh, just look at that pause the video whatever, and screenshots I haven't really used as much I don't really take many screenshots but uh, if I do this I would probably use JPEG, and that F10 is fine. Um, so that's that you can look at that but that's not really the most important thing 
Um, and yeah, that's about it for my settings for fraps. And if you have any questions, you can leave those below. And also make sure you leave a like and favorite this video if you found it helpful or you just want to help me out a lot. And if you're new to the channel, make sure you subscribe because I do put out a lot of content. And uh, I'm trying to expand the audience of people that enjoy it. So, thanks for watching.